Hey everybody, today we're going to be playing Clock some Bacchus for you. Uh, as much as I want to use this skin. We're not going to be using this skin. We are going to be using the new skin. It's French time! Mostly because I haven't gotten to use it and I want to use it and see how it goes. Uh, I actually got this skin from a, a friend, a viewer of mine, uh, Full and Kanda. He sent me a code for this skin, which is great because uh, I, I do get some codes for skins from high res, but I always use those for giveaways. So I didn't have this skin and he was like, hey, you can take mine. So, hey, it works out perfectly. Um, anyways, we are going to be going either Sands of Time or Conduit. I think we'll go with a Sands of Time into Bancrofts just to help with our mana issues. Uh, Conduit Gems gives lots of damage too, so that one's fine. Make sure we're getting our free drinks and fountain while we're here. And of course we go Sunder because Sunder is just too good. It's just too good. And we n all know Sunder is going to get nerfed. And when they nerf it, I hope they don't nerf... I mean, I don't even know what part they are going to nerf. But I mean, I just hope it's still fun to use after. There's a way they can nerf the item where it'll still be fun to use. And I'm hoping that is what will happen. But we won't, we won't know until that happens. Okay. Or at least I'm, I'm pretty sure they're going to nerf Sunder. I mean, it, it just feels kind of bonkers. Take the blue buff, and then we will head to lane, clear the wave, and then go for red. Okay, he is super slow. He might have done three buffs. Some people do that sometimes. They go red, blue, speed. Uh, but I've almost never seen it done. But based on the XP and gold, I think he only did two buffs. And he lost a lot of gold because he was late. Yeah. Dude, if I... If I sundered him before I used my two, we would have killed him even faster. Also, let's listen to voice back a little bit for this skin. Uh-oh. That's not the voice back. <laughs> oh, sorry, guys. I guess it has default for some reason. Why is it using default, Bacchus? Come on. I guess I can use the jokes and taunts. Bacon and eggs walk into a bar. Bartender says, we don't serve breakfast here. All this bacon shouldn't give them a heart attack, right? Oh, my goodness. Your middle tower. I love breakfast foods, personally. I don't eat them that, that often, though. How does one make good pancakes? You need a particular set of skillets. Eat me, bozo! <laughs> Silly skin. I like it, though. I don't think I'll use it that much, but... I don't know. Cool skin. Does it have a special? Oh, it does. Oh, he pours syrup all over himself. Oh, my God. That's great. That's great. Okay. If I can stun him and sunder him, we can kill him again, I think. But I do need to get him a little bit lower before we do that. And I also have to be careful of his execute. Nah. Just kidding, I didn't expect him to do so much damage with his blue stone, man. What Your the heck? Alright, we'll save our two a little bit more then. I don't think I could have killed him either, actually. Because I was going to get poke him out, and then the next round of abilities, I was going to stun Sunder to ult. Or ult, you know, first. But no, we couldn't do that that time. That sucks. I forgot about his execute, too, so let's just uh, chill. Let's just chill. However, your execute is down, dude. He doesn't have defense yet either. And I have two Sunder charges. Are you leaving? Please don't leave. Please don't leave. No, don't leave. That's okay. That's all right. Damn, he does damage. I'm gonna die again. 
Just kidding, he's gonna die. Got him. All right, let me recall, buy some items. So you guys may have noticed that I start Bancrofts in almost every Guardian. It's just honestly one of the better items. It gives a huge amount of power, huge amount of life still. And most importantly, when the fights are close, that's when you turn it. So if they ever nerf Bancrofts, I think at this point I can build other things. But uh, it is kind of a core item for me, I'd say. Your middle tower is under attack. Also, Soul Reaver will be great against Achilles, assuming he gets some uh, some health items, which I assume he will. Uh, but I'm also thinking about getting a Spear of the Mages. Spear of the Mages could be amazing here, because it'll proc on the first tick of my three and then increase damage for everything else. My Transcend is going to give him a lot of damage, though. Someone could take a bite out of here from nowhere! I still don't know what item he's building after Transcendence. He hasn't shown himself. He just missed a lot of minions. He's going into a Stone of Gaia? Okay. Also, I'm lagging a bit. Yikes. Uh, Stone of Gaia works against Bacchus, kind of. I mean, obviously, he gets it when I jump on him. But, oh, why would you do that? That's so sad. Um, but my I have anti-heal on my three. I have, like, 50% anti-heal, so I don't think it's that good. I think I just get Soul Reaver, and that destroys him. Not to mention I have Sunder, which only does percent health damage. No clue if his speed is up or not, but he stole my speed, so I'm going to go steal his. I'm uh, pretty sure it's down, considering there was that time where... Oh, never mind. I was going to say that long period of time where I didn't see him. Not this time. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I tried ulting for that. <laughs> I can't believe that happened. He, exec he he started his execute, and right as he hit me, I healed enough to not get executed. Oh, that was so funny. And then because I had Baycrofts and Sunder on him, I just turned around and killed him. Because I have so much power. Oh, that's so funny. Oh, I, I would... If I was Achilles, I'd be salty after that. I'd be upset. All right, we're getting Aegis. So he, we can't, you know, worry about any of that other... Yeah, you know what? Okay, yeah, we're getting Aegis to not worry about the execute anymore. And I'm going straight into Soul Reaver because A, he doesn't have defense, and B, he went a huge uh, health item. So I actually think we'll get some some damage out of Soul Reaver right now. Otherwise, I would go a defense item, Spear of the Mages, or possibly uh, just, I don't know, something else. But because he went Stone of Guy, which gives zero protections, but a bunch of health, I think rushing Soul Reaver is actually fine. Yeah, he is now is 1800. 200 health, that's not bad. We'll see how much Soul Reaver does. Also, keep in mind uh, when I Sunder him, if I apply Soul Reaver after that, Sunder will increase the damage of Soul Reaver. That. Okay, I do want to chase, but I don't want to chase like uh, too hard, or do I? Uh, is he not chasing me? I have my leap ready to bait him. Uh, his red buffs... Oh, he's still in the middle of the lane? Hold on. Hold on a second. Is he backing? Is he backing? Ooh, I'm not going to get him. Okay, well, I can get his red buff. It should be spawning now. Yeah, it just spawned. Cool. Well, now my combo's down, he has his ult, and I don't have my Aegis, so... Oh, well. 
I also cut myself off. What I meant to say, also for physical defense, I'll probably get a Emperor's. We don't want Breastplate because then we'll be overcapped late game with our starter item. But I cut myself off earlier when I said I don't want to dive him too hard. I like didn't want to go a beeline straight for him because otherwise he'd run away a lot faster. But it ended up happening anyways. Like sometimes you want to approach him kind of slow while waiting for cooldowns and it won't back up so much. I do that on Ymir all the time. It's hard to explain. I think if I recorded another Ymir game, it'd be easier to explain. Where like you're kind of just chilling, but you uh, you fully intend to dive him like crazy. You're just waiting for cooldowns. I'm putting pressure so that they don't back as well. Okay, now he's getting defense. And for our pen item, we can get a... I think just Spirit Mage just should be fine for now. Uh, as he gets double defense or something like that, we can think about a Rod of Tootie or an Obsidian. I don't really go Karen's Coin too often in duel. An item I should think about going again is Warlock Sash. I think Warlock Sash might be better on this map because it's easier to get stacks. Because Warlock Sash gives 10% pen. So if you get Warlocks and Rod, that's 20% right there. It gives some health and stuff too. Depends on who you're fighting. Obviously, Polly's a fun item on Bacchus, but if he gets too much defense, Polly's not going to help us until we get pen. So we got to keep that in mind. Please don't die, Tower. 73 health? Wait, no. Okay. 73 health on tower. Sweet. Sweet. Goodness. Where is he? He keeps disappearing. There he is. Hmm. All right, he finished his item. I don't want him to get his, his ability on me. Yeah, he shouldn't heal too much from that with Stone of God just because my three. Soul Gem works on Bacchus, I think. If I use my one, it uh, stacks Soul Gem, I'm pretty sure. I think I would do that against a Squishy God, though. Damn, he has a lot of HP 5, though. Maybe I need to just Divine so we have even more anti-heal. It's not even the Stone of Gaia passive. It's just the HP 5 from that and his ability. His ability is healing him. I have Aegis. Oh, he baited my ages. That was nice. It made it. He made it look like he was gonna execute me, and then turned around. So that uh, he got my ages for free. Wasn't able to apply the anti heal this bad. He's healing so much. Okay, I've made my decision based on the numbers I am seeing. We have anti heal, but we need more. So let's do that. Twenty four hundred health. All right, buddy. The soul reaver does. It's hitting like decent amount. Like it adds up. It adds up at the end of the fight. But I still need my cooldown from my starter item. Yeah, it's adding up. It's adding up to a decent amount. That's kind of a big counter. My god, dude, he's dangerous. 
Oh, I have my sunder. I have to get my two up while he has his execute. Heal with Bancroft. Don't let him heal too much off me. He will heal off minions though. He does have blink. So I gotta. Uh, if he blinks. If! Baby grease me up. <laughs> this this skin is so weird, man. <laughs> like I said, I don't I don't know if it's my type of skin, but it's kinda funny. Kinda silly. I like the silly skins. Sweet. Sweet. Goodness. Alright, he's leaving. Also, he healed so much health just out of combat. Yeah, if you start Conduit Gem on Bacchus, then I would say you would instead go Breastplate of Valor than Emperor's. Like, I think late game we'll have 30% we'll have cooldown uh, with Power Potion, unless I buy another item with 10%. But I think my final item is going to be Rod of Tehuti or something of the sort. Oh, I missed. That's very bad. He doesn't hit me that hard. Keeping in mind that I can't let him get those stone cutting procs for free. Why are you chasing me? Ah, oh, dude, I didn't do it fast enough. Yeah, I could have, I could have killed him there a hundred percent. Like. I should have, when he dove me under Phoenix, I didn't realize he was going to go so far. I could have killed him so easily, and I was late on it. And I was late on ulting, too. Although, I don't think my ult would have killed him there, even if I did hit it. But either way, well, who knows? But either way, yeah, I should have turned earlier. That's okay. We now should get some of tower. No, we don't get the entire thing, though. As long as he doesn't have Frostbound, man. Frostbound will kill me. He's going a physical defense item right now. Probably, what what could it be? Glad shield? I don't know. Uh, let's go rod. Mm. Ooh, grab me that can of whipped cream. Mm. Once again, I love Polynomicon on Bacchus, but I can't really build Polynomicon here. Uh, I just feel like most of the damage will get absorbed. In fact, my Soul Reaver, it's getting absorbed quite a bit, but that's why we're getting more pen. And I think Soul Reaver will be more power than Polly until, like, I have, like, power potion and stuff. Then Polly will have scaling with it. Also, it depends on if he keeps building more health items. If he cancels that every time, that'll be unfortunate. Keep my ages up, it's fine. This is so weird because he's so tanky. Like, if I can just keep using my abilities and running away and then coming back, we do win. But then he can just run away too. But if we just slap each other and hit each other, he will win the fight until I get my cooldown. Oh, we missed? Oh, I missed. No. This is okay. Uh oh. Once again, I don't know. I, sh I shouldn't have run away. I don't know. Once he missed the ult, I could have just hit him. Or once I aged, I could have just turned around. Like, he was, he was so low. But, I mean, it's okay because now I get tower. And I can, well, maybe not get red, but... Instead of getting Ratatouille right away, I'm going to upgrade my starter item because we are level 20. I'm going to just sell my ward. I, I like wards, but uh, they're not like crazy important on this map. On the other map, I would have uh, not sold my ward because you need it on Demon King for a lot of times. So we have 600 power now. 
I think it might be worth uh, swapping out an item for Polly now that we're getting towards late, late game. Uh, definitely not Rotitude or Divine, though. I don't know. I, like, I, I, I want Soul Reaver to be doing more damage, but it's it's just not, actually. This seems to be the theme of whenever I buy Soul Reaver lately. Well, 127 for one ability is pretty good. I mean, that's a lot of scaling. Like, if an ability had 100% scaling, that's 127 extra power. It's like, if you think about it that way. And actually, that's it's even more because that's an unmitigated. It's hitting for like two, 200 and some. Just it's getting mitigated. Also, once we get Polly, we can poke down Phoenix more. Let's go take buffs. We we're trying to rush and get our Rod Tootie. We did get Glad Shield. I mean, I could even sell Bancrofts for Polly, maybe. Polly gives 95 power on its own, so I would be missing out on quite a bit. But I think I would make up for it with the extra damage for Polly. I think so. I think so. Especially with red buff. With red buff and power potion, I think the scaling is there. Is it a little scary of a fight? It's a little scary. Oh! No, he went under me. I should have taken that into account. All right, push the wave. He's probably instant recalling. I don't think I can chase him. He has way more mobility than me. I still have my Aegis up too. No, why are you talking to me? Oh God. <laughs> I realized if I just leaped forward, he would have caught me no matter what. So I was thinking maybe if I actually cut this corner, because I have a leap and he doesn't, I could actually get away. But yeah, if I just leaped like straight, he just would have gotten his ability up and hit me. Because he gets two dashes. So I tried to make a hopeless situation a little bit hopeful, but... Uh, oh well, bad pathing from me, trying to get my escape there. I kind of changed my mind throughout, which is okay. I now have power potion. We now have full build. I have a lot of power. Um, yeah, we well, let's let's see what happens. Ooh, hopefully he doesn't get my phoenix though. Does he have uh, power potion? I know he is a fast boy. Not gonna lie, that was brilliant. He did what people do against Ymir. He turned around and ran towards them. Because Bacchus is three is a cone, so by running towards me, it's actually kind of hard to hit the ability and get the stud. Damn, okay. I see that people doing that all the time to my Ymir, but not to my Bacchus. All right, buddy. Yeah, when we have the gold, I'll swap. I think Bancroft's out for Polly. I think that'll be fine. Bancroft's is more to get through the early game. Uh, if it's my only power item, I keep it in the late. But here, it's not, so I think it's fine. Ooh, the blink. Oh, I missed, but he missed too, so it's okay. Ah, I can't even take his phoenix. It's like I can't chase him. I know I can't really chase him. Especially when he has fire minions. I can't even clear the wave right now. 
I have 30% cooldown. But I kind of wish I had 40. Let's get this. Get some wards. Upgrade our Aegis. Okay. Yeah, we still have 745 power. This is good. This is good. I would really, really, really like to get a red buff, though. Someone I think that would give us just enough damage. Ooh, but he's going for it. I can go for the other one, though. I can go for the other one. This is okay. Uh, assuming he doesn't backdoor me, which I don't think Achilles can. Not with that build. All right. Yeah, my I have almost 900 power. Wow. Here we go. Here is the here is the fight of the game. We both have red buff. We both are full build. Let's see what happens. Look at that damage. I had to be pretty careful about that. We both do way too much damage. I almost feel like if he had an item that wasn't Stone of Guy, he would beat me. Like I don't, I can't imagine Stone of Guy was is helping that much. Either way, the game's not over. I mean, hell, can I even kill Phoenix because I'm having to fight these fire minions? I'm so far away. I do have Emperors though. Emperors, I think, will allow us to take this. Come on, minions, I need you for the backdoor protections. Not gonna lie, I'm walking all the way back to base. <laughs> or at least most of the way, because he has Blink. And I'm not about to lose to Blink. Because even if I walk all the way back to base, I don't lose anything. There's no downside to doing this. Alright, now I feel okay backing. My Phoenix is up again. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about Emperors in Duel. I don't know if it's scummy or if it's just, like, just good. I think it's just good on this map. That's how I think it is. Oh, I missed my poly shot. That's bad. I wish I could. I kind of want to wait for my double sunder, but who knows? Nah, we can't get him. I played a little bit too aggressive there, and I scared him off. I scared him off before I had the combo ready to kill him. But that's okay. Our Phoenix is healing. So it's a win at the end of the day. Now I do have to back because I can't stay. I don't have enough uh, enough life still to stay is what I meant to say. Like with Bancrofts, yeah, you can heal off the wave. But wave, but with just Polly, no, no, you can't. You'll have a crazy advantage if I stay. Red buffs are coming up again pretty soon. Ooh, so delicious. I think my build is fine against his build. Uh, Empress could be swapped since his Phoenix is down. I thought he was walking forward. Whoops. Oh, I thought he was going to dash forward, man. I tried to predict it. I tried to predict it. I thought he saw how low health I was. And when I leaped, I assumed he was going to dash forward to dodge it. But if I did max range, uh, 
I would have landed. I still would have missed him, but uh, it would have been worse for me. But you know, whatever. Ooh, out of range. Let's just go get red buff. This is this is a little too scary. This is a little too scary considering I I'm not applying my anti heal. Uh, and he's just dealing with stone a guy and his two. So we'll just play it safe or at safer, I should say. Hey, there are hungry people everywhere. It's like now if he tried to fight, my ult's up in two seconds. So I think I would be okay with it. Ooh, this is scary, this is scary, this is scary. No! Did he get a 3k pot? I doubt it. But he might have, because I, I can afford a 3k pot. No, he definitely has one. Oh, that's okay. He still can't end because I have that wave is a fire wave. He will get Phoenix, but he can't end because his tank his build is just so tanky. He has one, two, three tank items. And I mean the rest of the items are amazing for killing Titan super fast. It's okay. So I'm okay with taking that fight. Even though I lost it, I'm okay with taking it because if I killed him, I would have won the game. Since I lost the fight, I just lose Phoenix, which is perfectly fine. And now I can get 3k pot. <laughs> Did you think I didn't have my leap, buddy? He really wanted that, didn't he? I, I was actually, con I was thinking about it. I was like, I should leap on him for a ton of damage because I have my, you know, my red potion going, my 3k pot. Then I was like, I better not because my Aegis is down. That's what I was thinking in my head. And it's a good thing I didn't because, wow, that worked out well. Now this is the reverse of last fight because now he died. But, I mean, I can get Phoenix, but I can also just get red buff. Or no, red, that red buff's down. Never mind, never mind. I forgot about that. Ooh, I can't even really get Phoenix here. I should have just gone for it and ignored the minions. I could have one-shot it with Polly. Now it's a little dangerous to do that. We'll see. I do have my Aegis too. If he backs, I just take Phoenix, by the way. I have Aegis too, so I'm not scared of this. My A oh no! I was using my one, so I couldn't Aegis. I was smashing my Aegis, but I used my one like an idiot. Oh no, the plan did not go according to plan. Or the, what should I, what did I say? That fight didn't go according to plan. Yeah, I, I, I used my one like an idiot, and then I couldn't use my Aegis because I was in the middle of an animation. If he books it over here, yeah, he's here. Ooh, I don't know. I don't know. Titan's buggy. Come on, Titan. Don't be buggy. Oh, no. I'm pretty sure I lost. Pretty sure. However, he's taking his sweet time. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No way! I kind of wish I didn't use my other ability, but that's okay. I didn't need all. I just panicked. Because I, I really could alt this wave. Or I wish I did, could have. 30 seconds? Mm. Forget the wave, forget the wave. I could do it with Polly. Or maybe this is going to be a back and forth. Oh, dude, I, I definitely have to try to add here because if I don't... No, I can't. I can't. I can't. I was going to say I have to try to end because otherwise he's just going to go for my Someone Phoenix or my Titan. Oh, am 
my phoenix is coming up. Oh, nobody's chasing me. No, this is the worst. This is the worst. If he chases me, that's even worse. Okay. Damn, I should have taken that red. He went back to wave. Did someone say... We have to defend this Phoenix with everything we have. With our double sunder. Every second this Phoenix is up, I heal. My Titan heals. Oh my god, this game is intense. What the hell? This guy's good, dude. He's had some nice plays. It is interesting. He should be pushing right now with those fire wave minions. I don't know. I feel like he should. Need to get a good fight here. Heals so goddamn much. Oh my goodness! What a crazy fight! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Go! 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 Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Go minions! Go! Come on! Come on! Come on! Twenty-six seconds. We should have this. I'm killing the minions this time because I made that mistake last time. Well, I don't know if it's a mistake. I think I just wasn't able to end either way. And that should be game GG. That was the best Bacchus game. That was so close. Well played to this Achilles. Hats off to this Achilles. He had some nice plays like when he was uh, running towards me and Juke with the three and some nice alts. It's just generally fun match overall. Super close. Uh, I mean, honestly, he might as well have won it. I mean, it, my attack was one auto attack away. It was so close. So crazy close game. Thank you guys for watching. GG well played, man. That was crazy close. Uh, truly is the spell of the game, yeah. Ooh. I don't know what it means by that, but oh well. I, I, maybe he's referring to my emperors and the fact that I had to stay back and stuff. I don't know. Either way, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. And I'll see you guys next time.